Introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Lonnie Taylor. I am from Grambling State University, and this is my summer 2010 at uh, my first time at a research uh, facility, I guess, doing a research internship for Jackson State University. My major is computer science, and this is the REU program. Why do you choose the REU program in wireless ad hoc networks and sensor networks at Jackson State University? I chose to do wireless sensor networks because I had done a senior project on uh, wireless sensor networks trying to simulate what would happen in the event that some situation wasn't to try and improve the range of a wireless sensor a wireless sensor in the network and well what I got from the experience I wanted from what I got from the experience I wanted to learn a little bit more about wireless sensor networks and the basics and what would happen in just basically what would happen because I didn't really know all that much about wireless sensor networks. Okay. Now you are on fourth week. How do you feel is the program so going so far? I'm learning I'm learning a lot. I'm doing a lot. So far it's it was a little bit slow going at first but um, as as the time went by I began to learn to use things in my programming that I've never used before and basically I'm getting I'm getting a lot of good programming experience out of this research internship. What are your career goals and how do you see the RGA program at Jackson State University will contribute towards your career goal? Well, I want to I just want to start out in the field first to see just how strong my, if my my beliefs about my programming skills are actually where they are first, just to start out with. And then I also want to go to graduate school. I want to get my degree in aerospace engineering or possibly computer science because I feel that computers are a very important part of today's society and they are everywhere we go so as much as programmers are pretty much needed in just about every aspect of everyday living and I see this I see this program as helping me with that because as I said before it's a good experience in what in a research environment and how it's expect is helping me to learn what to expect when I go into other situations of the same type what do you feel about the mentoring experience you have received so far? And do you want any changes in the way you're being mentored? So far, I've met a lot of different people in the, in the different areas of computer science. I've met um, my professors from my school, of course. They each have their own projects besides teaching. And I've met uh, department heads from department chair from Jackson State University. I've also met other students that were in this exact same program at this school. And I pretty much learned about their lifestyles and how they, how their, everyone was, how everyone acts and are expected to act at this, at this school. And I just feel that so far this program has done a good job of showing me what life has been, what life is like at this school and what it will mo pretty much will be like for the, my next four years as I think about what area to decide to do for my research, whether I'm doing th thesis or coursework for my graduate school degree. In a scale of one to five, one being poor and five being excellent, how strong do you feel in the area of wireless ad hoc networks and sensor networks? Right now, I would say I'm in the middle at three because at first, when I first started on my project in college, I was at a zero, a one. I wasn't that good at all because I didn't know anything. But right now, I feel like I'm at least capable of doing something with this project. What you consider are, are the plus points of this RU program and what you consider are its minus points, if any? 
Well, I kind of like the the fact that everybody was so welcoming and so concerned about our well-being. And I kind of like also that they made sure that we had enough information, background information to do our projects, to, to try and learn and research our projects from the beginning. Um, they pre they treated they treated us well like we were actually students here, like that we belonged here. Considering the fact that they have so many different students that come from different backgrounds and different different places all over the country, so I'm not exactly having a negative experience with this program. You have started to code for your research project. How do you compare the coding experience? with other programming projects you have done so far in your career? It's intensive, I could say that at least. Um, I, this is my first re research experience, but it's not my first internship. I've been on two previous internships and where I also, on one of the other occasions, I also had to do some programming, but it was it was more like scripting. So as, as I go, this is basically I'm feel that since this is coming directly from scratch from it's really intensive because of the fact that I've had to start from the bottom and work my way up. It's where it's from instead of just starting from where someone else has left off and then trying to improve upon what they've done or try and insert my my two cents I guess I would say into how I feel the program should be how the program should be done from what aspect to start from.